Yesterday, I said that Perplexity is making all other AI systems look like trash. Well, Claude have just released a new feature today, which is making me want to backslide and cheat on Perplexity. Anthropic have just released an update to their artifacts feature, and I can't believe how awesome it is. It's literally changed my perception of how quickly you can build and deploy with AI. And I'm going to show you that in real time today. Before I show you what's really possible, I need to show you this artifact space they've built because this isn't just a simple update. It's a change in trajectory of how Claude works. You'll see this is the normal chat box that you get with any of these AI models. But on the left here, you've got this artifacts button. And now when you click it, you get this whole space of apps and tools that are ready built for you. You can see here, there's all sorts of like simple stuff that already in this space for you to start using, whether that's a writing editor, flashcards, all sorts of things. There's this one I love that I've been playing. I've got to admit, I was playing this a little bit today. Slime soccer in here. If you went to school with me, you'll know we spent hours uh, playing this little slime soccer game, which, you know, it's pretty simple and it's been around on the web for ages, but it's more to the point. It's just a very simple explanation of the sort of stuff you can build in Claude, but you can see that anyone can start building and publishing apps and tools within Claude within seconds. You don't need to pay for another tool. You don't need to use everything else. You can start building stuff right in this system on this platform. Now you could hit this new artifact button and it's gonna give you an option of the sort of stuff you can build. You can start building your productivity tools, games, documents and templates, apps and websites, creative projects and deploy them all within Claude. So yeah, you can see what other people have built, but this is where it gets really interesting. I'm gonna build something right now in just a few minutes that would usually take me hours and probably cost a bit to actually build and deploy even a simple tool that's going to help my business and help you as my audience members. So I'm just going to open the regular normal chat here. And I'm just going to say, I'm just going to sort of prime it a bit and just let it know that let's create an artifact and just sort of start telling it what I want. It's giving me options of the sort of different things I can build, but I do have something very specific in mind and I want to build something related to my business. I want something SEO related, maybe like a topical map creator. I could gather up loads of keywords and the artifact is an app that creates a complete topical map with content title, nested keywords, pillar content, supporting topics, meta title description, plus even a content outline. Is that possible? So I want to build a micro tool or an AI powered tool that actually I've paid for this stuff in the in the past, so I'm interested to see whether I can build and deploy something with Claude in a matter of minutes. This is a brand new channel, and if you get anything from this video at all, do me a digital handshake, hit the subscribe button, and comment with where you are on your journey below. And this literally took a couple of minutes to actually build the first outline of this tool, which is pretty cool. I mean, it looks pretty basic at the moment, but the moment of truth really is whether this actually works. And I did play around a little bit more and actually I decided I wanted to make it look and feel a bit more modern. So I did ask, this is literally, we did that one prompt, which was just priming and getting going. One prompt, two prompts here. I did a second one. Can we improve the design to make it really feel modern? Include glowing covers like vivid magenta and vibrant green. And this is what it came up with. Look, I'm not a designer, but you know, it gives it a little bit more flavor than we had before. Transform your keyword chaos with AI powered clustering and next gen SEO intelligence. Big promise. I want to see if it actually works. There are some uh, sample keywords there, but let's see if I can actually find, I've got some keywords here for a previous client that we were talking about brand consistency and we collected all these up and you can see they're not clustered on this page, but we want to see if we can cluster these keywords for SEO into a really nice topical cluster so we can get lots of different content segments that are going to make us an authority on Google. So if we pop them in there, this is the moment of truth to see if it works. Generating magic. It, man, literally in the click of a button, it kind of got to work and did stuff. We can see here, now we've just got to check if it's actually any good. So we can see here, pillar content. This is the branding content title for my main pillar post, ultimate guide to branding strategies and best practice. So this is a, a bulky blog post that's targeting these particular keywords. You can see it's built me the content outline here. So we've got an outline of what we need to include in this post, which actually looks pretty good. Like you'd expect, I guess an SEO article would. And then what's really cool is it has seemingly clustered up the keywords or broken them down into supporting topics with target keywords, consistency and branding. It's given me a meta title. It's given me a meta description. And then it's given me the outline of what we should be talking about in this. What is consistency and branding, getting started guide, best practices. This is cool. Like it literally did this in a click of a button. So it's built out all my topic pillars and clustered keywords in them, allegedly. 
Um, it might need a bit of tweaking and stuff, but to be fair, in like a few minutes to be able to build just a little tool like this, which can sort of start working. I don't think it's perfect, but like, damn, it's pretty good for what for what I needed it to do. And we built that just off a conversation, almost like close to a professional tool that could be useful, that I could use for my own work or give out for clients maybe, or even go and build stuff for other people. If they've got a small problem they need solving, you could build stuff really quickly. But the next bit is what's really cool is you can just hit this published button and make this tool, this little AI powered tool, which is so quick to build available to the public in an artifact. So we can copy that link and we could go and open it up in another browser window, for example, and boom, you can start using this topical map. So I'm going to put this link in the description as well for other people to try it out and see what they think, whether it's actually any good or not. We'll have to get a few people using it to get some feedback, but you can see it's loaded up some sample keywords, or you could put your own ones in there and see how it how it sort of does again like i've only just built this in like live while we're watching so um you know it might need some tweaking and improving but that's pretty cool to be able to do so so quickly within claude we went from idea to publicly available tool literally in the space of this youtube video in the space of a couple minutes and that completely changes the game either for content creators or for business owners who can solve problems really quickly or just create micro tools for their audience for their customers for their internal businesses in a matter of seconds with no real effort. And speaking of no real effort, you can check out this video that I did 471% more efficient with these nine AI tools. And it doesn't include chat GPT.